A recent research project by University of Otago students is revealing a unique insight into the activities of some local social services. Alan Shanks is the Chief Executive of the Council of Social Services Dunedin and he joins us to explain the study. Good evening. Good Tell evening. us about this project. The students came from the Media, Film and Communication Department of the University and they were looking as part of their um, study strategic communication Public relationships, principles and practices was their main sort of focus in wow. the sector. Mm. How did they do their research? Well, they were assigned, there were seven groups assigned to uh, seven different charities around Dunedin. And so what they did was they actually uh, interviewed the managers uh, of these particular organisations, had a look um, at what their particular approach to was social media and how they actually communicated with different clients within their organisations. Mm. What did you want to achieve? They were really trying to achieve um, and looking at concepts of how the sector differs from, say, the public or business sector. So part of that was to really research a little bit of how the sector, the social sector in particular, how they use their social media to reach out to the public and to their clients. And what did they discover? Well, it was an interesting uh, discovery, really. They found that a lot of the organisations were very enthusiastic about having them part of this particular project. And what they found was some of the organisations were very much up to speed with social media and how they were getting their information and services out to the community. Others were a little bit sort of still stayed in their ways and so as part of what they really found was that some of them really needed to be a little bit more sort of proactive in how they actually communicated out there into the mm. community. Mm. How has this project benefited the students? Well for them it was really looking at, at the concepts and how they differ from say the public and commercial sector. And, and how it relates to the, the actual um, social sector and what those differences are. Mm. Mm. Will you use their research? Certainly. We found that the three that actually came to come to the final awards night were very well put together projects which we'll now use to um, create some future forums. Mm. How are social service agencies faring in Dunedin? I was hoping to bring some good news, but I'm <laughs> sorry it's not like that. Really, there is quite a lot of challenges still happening within the sector, very much so. And they would have been hit especially hard last week, I guess, as well? Um, yes, as part of um, the social welfare a group that we were part of in the civil defence, we were able to draw some of those social services mm. into that particular area. What are, yeah. the, what are the sector's main challenges? Right, there's three main challenges coming into the future now. On the 1st of April, the government rolled out um, the charity services, which now are looking to roll out um, particular accountability around financial reporting. So charities will now have to be very much in line with what they are providing as far as financial reporting is concerned. Mm -hmm. And the uh, other two? The other one is the um, Productivity Commission, which the government have actually put together, asking this commission to look at services that the government provide out into the community and are they being properly sort of funded? Um, do they need to really look at some other changes so that they are you know, complying with what the government are looking for? Mm. The one that's just recently happened over the last two or three days is the uh, community investment strategy and this in some ways will affect social services particularly going forward looking at if there's any duplication happening and therefore if there is some organisations may find themselves uh, having to close down, mm. which is not a good particular position to be in. Are these things insurmountable? Um, I think they've been coming for a long time, so it's not as if it's a total surprise that this is coming out, but I think organisations need to be really much aware, and we as an organisation can provide some of that support and information if they need be. Chief Executive of the Council of Social Services, Dunedin, Alan Shanks, thank you so much for your time. Thank you.